happy Saturday. I've got my Bath and Body Works empties, and i got a few other empties in here <laughs> to show you guys today. And I just wanted to just chat a little bit about what's going on at Bath and Body Works. So they are not opening their stores. Thank goodness. I'm really glad that we're all doing the um, stay-at-home thing for the most part, if we can, because that way the people that have to work, um, there's less people out there that can be spreading this coronavirus. So I don't know how to emphasize it enough. If you're able to stay home, stay home. I keep telling, you know, elderly people that I know, don't go out to the grocery store every day. Stay home. Go once a week if you have to, or ask someone who's younger to deliver groceries. And I feel like everybody's like, you know, wanting to go out because by nature we want to go out and it's hard to stay home. But I know a lot of people in the medical profession and um, that's what they're telling me. If you're able to, the less people that are out there, the more it helps everybody else. So like, that's my message for today. Stay home if you can. Um, one good thing that came out of this. So our, our local um, fire and police department put out a call. They needed hand sanitizer. And I'm like, I got hand sanitizer, so I was able to donate a bunch of my hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works to our police and fire. So that's kind of one good thing that you can do in the community. What I did was I just put it in a bag, and I left it in front on the sidewalk, and then they came and they got the bag. We were all six feet away. But, um, you know, that's one thing, you know, that maybe you could do if you want to help out. I know a lot of people are making masks. I really don't know how to do that. But, um, you know, there's a lot going on out there. Bath and Body Works online. And, oh my gosh, you guys, you know, who knows what the right answer is in all this. I am still ordering from Bath and Body Works online. I am able to. Um, I'm so fortunate that I, I, I work at home. Um, and I don't know if it's the right thing to do. I've kind of grappled with that a little bit. Should I not be ordering? Should I be ordering because it helps the economy? I don't know. Um, so right now I am ordering. I did get, like I said, the new um, hand soaps. I did get the diamond, the, the diamond illuminating, <laughs> what's it called? The illuminating shiver mist from Perfect Peony. I have that coming and then I have more of the Mother's Day soap. I also did donate a ton of my soap to the fire department too. So I don't care if I get new soap because I can just take my old soap, um, you know, not old, it's like, <laughs> like three months old. We all know I have a lot of soap and I can give it to the police and fire department, but um, that's what I'm trying to do. I don't know. A lot of people are saying, you know, watch out for the packages. I'm pretty careful with the packages. So um, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> Let me know below what, what your thoughts are on any of this. I'm just, I, I'm really hoping you guys that if we stay at home, the, this thing will peak and then we'll be on the downside, and then by like, you know, end of May into June, semi-annual sale, who knows, we'll all have a big celebration because we'll be so excited to the semi-annual sale. But I've got my um, empties here today. And, you know, it's hard being a YouTuber, by the way, because you don't know what to say. I mean, we're all in this together. That's the only, like, you know, it's not like, you know, someone in Kansas isn't going through the same thing as someone in Ohio. We are all in this together, so... Empties. We went through an entire bottle of tea tree special. I actually have another one of these. Um, shampoo. This is one of my favorite shampoos aside from the Lush Hair Bar. It makes me happy. <laughs> the scent of this one. So I got that. And then, oh my gosh, washing hands. I have already used up an entire Somebody Loves You, which is the um, sprinkled donut. So good. There's four of us in our house. You know what? It's crazy because what? What? I, I wish I, I want to recycle these bottles into something. I got. I got to find something to make out of these bottles. But um, it literally. That's what we're doing. I mean, like anytime I like touch anything, I'm just like, and we're all in the house together. But I just wash my hands. It's become such a habit now. Hand washing. Um, I have an av uh, vanilla and avocado. Um. I went through a Peeling Good banana. I love this banana. I'm glad I got like three or four of these because this is like straight on banana. I still want a banana body care. Um, and I went through the Stay Positive Ice Vanilla Cupcake. I'm still speculating, you know, you got to have hope. That's the other thing. And you got to, you know, 
think good things are coming. And, you know, what makes me happy is thinking about maybe in fall, you know, we're going to have our sweet cinnamon pumpkin back. I can't wait for that. <laughs> so that's that's my hope. Um, Aloha Honolulu Sun. I went through one of these. I don't like that one as much, though. It's okay. It's a little, it's a little strong. Peach Prosecco. I had this in my um, bathroom. That one's nice. I like the Peach Prosecco. Um, and then I used up a Black Cherry Merlot. I don't want to throw this bottle out. It's so pretty. I don't know. I have to find something to do with these bottles. <laughs> and then I have uh, one of the Purely Clean. I haven't been using the Purely Clean as much. I don't know why. It's like psychologically I keep thinking maybe these are stronger, so I've been using these. It's probably no difference. Um, and then I, I got through a Dream in the Sky uh, shower gel, and then my mom used up one of the Vanilla Bean Noel um, moisturizing uh, body washes. So we love this. I mean, I actually got um, that in the coconut. This is going in the shower next. I can't wait to try this coconut because this just smells really good. It's like a pure on coconut. So, those are my empties. I don't think I'm throwing these out. Number one, um, I don't want to, like, fill up the garbage can too much. I don't know. I want to see what I maybe I can make out of these. <laughs> That's my goal. But anyway, those are my empties for March. Um, for those of you who are just joining me, or who um, haven't seen some of the stuff, some of the things that are new at Bath & Body Works Online, the coconut pineapple has been kind of my best friend. It kind of calms me down, and it's a really nice um, pineapple coconut scent. Coconut hibiscus and coconut palm are all online currently, and they come in the fine fragrance mist. I actually, believe it or not, I got these. You know, it it, it kind of makes me a little bit sad to think about, but um, it, this is a weird story, you guys. So I went to the mall on March, what was that? I think it was March 7th or 8th. It was that weekend. Because what happened was, I don't know if you guys noticed, I'm wearing my old glasses. Because I got, I went to Lens Crafters and I got a new pair of glasses that day. And I think it was the Sunday. It was like the 8th. And um, I got the glasses. And when I got them home, about a week later, the anti-scratch stuff started peeling off. So I called them and they're like, well, you have to come in. And, you know, I'm like, I'm not coming in. <laughs> I'm going to lens crafters. So I actually switched them. So when this is all over, I got to get new glasses. I actually ordered a pair of glasses online. We'll see if those show up. But anyway, I am wearing my old glasses again. And that day, which was March 8th, I had gone into Bath and Body Works. And um, one of our amazing Bath and Body Works associates said, oh, well, I have some of the coconut line that just came in. Do you want it? And I actually did pay full price for it. <laughs> And I was going to go in and get my price adjustment. So I'm like, <laughs> I never got my, that's okay. I don't even care <laughs> that I didn't get my price adjustment. You know what? The world is more important. But anyway, I just kind of, um, you know, this was actually my last trip into the Bath and Body Works store. So it's kind of sentimental to me that I'm like, oh my gosh, I can, this is my hope that, you know, in two months, all of this is going to, you know, be settled down, we're going to get back to our regular lives, and we're going to be able to go into Bath and Body Works again, and I'm going to thank my Bath and Body Works people profusely. <laughs> They're all getting, you know, a big hug. <laughs> so anyway, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my little empty video here. It wasn't that exciting today because it was all soap. But anyway, um, like I said, all of this is online right now, and Perfect Peony is out and I don't know what they're going to be doing next. I don't know if they're going to be manufacturing new products for like summer and spring, if they're hauling back on their stuff. I don't know. I have no idea what's going on. So um, we will wait and see together. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.